Goldfish are a popular ornamental domesticated fish species, and their phenotypic traits are highly diverged. These varieties have been established by breeders and fanciers. In this video, I want to explain how early breeders and fanciers succeeded to make twin-tail goldfish strain. Twin-tail goldfish has a laterally bifurcated caudal fin. The caudal fin skeleton consists of fin rays and axial skeleton. This means the twin tail goldfish has a bifurcated axial skeleton. No other vertebrate species has such a bifurcated axial skeletal system. This suggests that a rare mutation may have occurred during goldfish domestication. In 2014, we reported that the bifurcated caudal skeleton arises from a mutation in the coding gene. Coding is one of the most significant genes for the embryonic dorsal ventral patterning. We demonstrated that the formation of the bifurcated caudal axial skeleton requires a stop codon mutation in one of two recently duplicated coding genes. It is also reported that the mutation of coding gene causes the lethal phenotype in most of the model organisms. Unlike these coding mutant model organisms, goldfish can survive nicely presumably because of the duplicated coding genes. One coding gene is mutated but the other is still okay. This paralog of coding gene may compensate for the reduction of the function of mutated coding gene. These duplicated coding genes may have enabled the emergence of the twin tail phenotype, and the twin tail phenotype was selected by goldfish breeders and fanciers in Ming Dynasty, China. And now we can see the twin tail goldfish in a fish tank. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. See you next time. Thank you.